Hi everyone, my name's Ben Webb. I'm uh, cutting the laser plates for uh, splitting and brood excluders. And I'm here with Doug Irvine in Brisbane. And we've been, I've been working with Doug on um, improving his boxes. And I thought we'd just do a quick little impromptu video just to say g'day and uh, show off what we've done, worked out together. So um, Doug, tell, tell us what's going on here. First of all, he's worked out something pretty cool with his his um, box there. What's going on there? Well, the little known fact that an overpipe is almost the perfect dimensions to carry in a woolly shopping bag. There you go, let's have a look. Now, we'll have an unveiling, eh? The perfect size. There you go. Now, for a good many years, I cut out my own Persplex splitting plates. It's a cow of a job. And more recently I started doing it with plywood because it was simpler and easier. But then I heard about Ben and what he was doing. So now Ben's cutting my laser, laser cutting my, my plates. And that's what they look like. Perfect fit, inexpensive, and uh, I don't have to do it myself. Very good. Yeah. Although we've got a we've got a bit of a surprise for you. This is something that um, no one's seen yet. So this is uh, Doug's little secret idea here, and we've been working away iterating some uh, lots of versions of the design. Uh, so let's have a look at this. It's pretty cool. Yeah. A normal brood excluder cuts off about here and allows the bees access up into the honey super but a good many people like to be able to have a viewing panel and if you save the little cut out and make a cap to fit that hole you have a viewing panel now I know that viewing panel in time is going to get all sorts of build up on the bottom side but initially if you were to take the viewing panel out and wrap the undersides with glad wrap and put it back in I think you've got a renewable means of making that viewing panel last for some time until the bees begin to fill the, the brood chamber up and then it's a matter of removing that plug and the viewing panel then becomes a brood excluder to allow you to utilize the honey super. There you go. So we're very excited about that and uh, let us know if you're interested in that concept and we can certainly uh, laser one of them up for you to try. But uh, Doug's selling his hives at the moment and that's his new improvement. So they'll all be featured in his, uh, his hives, which are set the standard, if I say myself. Look at that, perfect. And you, fantastic. All right, thanks very much, Doug. It's been a pleasure working with you. And uh, let, let me know, you can uh, post below if you'd like uh, a hive from Doug or you can post below if you'd like some laser, laser cut plates from me. Thanks very much, see you.